Morning guys, uh, I'm sitting here in a British community venue and it feels a little bit strange and a little bit odd. It feels kind of wrong to be in a place that's uh, very empty, had had a deep clean and is, is now just sitting uh, waiting for something to happen. And, uh, and that reminded me that actually the other day I turned to the wrong psalm. I wanted to read from Psalm 42. I wanted to read a passage that uh, that has helped me so many times when things seemed strange and things seemed odd. Psalm 42 has all the way through it and, and Psalm 43 as well, different points where the psalmist actually says, why my soul are you downcast? Why so disturbed within me? Put your hope in God, for I will yet praise him, my saviour and my God. As you could probably see there, my eyes were just flicking onto the words because I'd really love to have that skill and that ability, that way of remembering where scripture is to be able to recite it off. I know quite a few passages, but some of them seem to elude me and that was exactly what happened. I turned to Psalm 41 instead and then I read the opening verses and it really struck me. It says this in Psalm 41, Blessed are those who have regard for the weak. The Lord delivers them in times of trouble. The Lord protects and preserves them. They are counted among the blessed in the land. I was quite overwhelmed, as you could probably imagine, when I read those words and, and thought upon them. That at, in these times when, when the country is going on lockdown and shutdown, actually eyes are turning. Eyes are turning for the weak and the vulnerable, those in need, our neighbours, our friends. It may even be you caught up and self-isolating in a home and someone else is doing that for you. It's really important in these days that we realise that God is in the midst of us. God is in the midst of all that takes place. And even though these seem strange, wrong and uncharted days, God is still at work. In fact, God is at work even more powerfully now than before because maybe just maybe our eyes and our hearts are focusing on him more as Dave said in his video press into God more press into one another press into our community let's be people who take this unexpected turn this new now and bring it for God's purpose and his glory I wonder if you could pray with me as we pray for even if we are having doors closed that he would open doors to the vulnerable and the weak. Lord, bless this day. Lord, bless the vulnerable and the weak. Lord, may we have regard for them and may our hearts not be troubled, even in days of trouble. Because Lord, you are the great God. You are sovereign over all and we praise your holy name. May we be preserved enough to serve others for your glory. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. Have a wonderful day, guys. See you soon.